Hmm. I think I sold out Amazon with you guys. Yep. Okay, so first of all, before I start the video, I just want to say like, don't buy cards from Amazon right now because, for example, this simple XFX card is going for about $750 and some simple cards like the Sapphire Nitro RX 480s are going for $550. So this is just absolutely crazy. We sold out Amazon just absolutely crazy. So that's just what I wanted to say to you guys. Okay, so the video of today is about Windows 10 updating by itself. As you all know, Windows has some sort of update for the RX 400 series that just uninstalls your drivers simply just with one click of a mouse button without you doing anything. So I'm gonna show you really quickly on how to turn Windows updates off on Windows 10 because most people can't find it and it's just gonna be a short video. Okay, so what you have to do is just press the Windows key and press R. I will put everything in the comments below so you can find it pretty easily. What you have to type in here is gpedit.msc. On some computers it doesn't work, but that means that you're not an administrator and that's a totally different story. But this is for the most people that's gonna work, so hopefully it's for everyone that's watching this video. So you just have to press enter and you will see your local group policy editor and what you have to do is just uh, make the box a little bit bigger because it's going to be pretty tough if it's too small. So first of all, you want to go to administrative templates. Then we're going to Windows components and scroll all the way down. And you will find Windows Update and just press Windows Update. In here, you will find Configure Automatic Updates. And you probably think, like, hey, Buried, you're going way too fast. But I, I said to you, I'm going to put it in the comments below, so don't worry about it. What do you have to do in the configure automatic updates? You will have to right click it and go on edit. So we're going to edit our automatic updates on Windows. It's probably going to be on not configured like on everyone's computer. But what we're going to do, we're going to go and enable this configure automatic updates. So what do we want to do is automatic download and notify for install is what it's going to do. So it's going to download the drivers and it's going to notify you like, hey, I'm going to restart your computer and then it's updating the computer and you're screwed when it's going to put on the driver update. So what do we want to do is notify for download and notify for install. So it's going to ask like, hey, can I download this update for you and notify you for installation? So we're just going to pick that one and save it just apply it and press OK. So that was the only thing you need to do to turn off Windows updates with this simple trick. So hopefully it's gonna work out for you guys too and you're not gonna have too many problems. But I'm also gonna make the video about the basic BIOS mod for every card that's available. It's gonna be for Alpida, Hynix and Samsung. Unfortunately, Micron is a totally different world we're gonna make a different video for that so i'm gonna re-upload the videos for bios modding your cards because the 500 series are are out this uh week and whatsoever months and soon enough the vega comes out too so hopefully you all enjoyed this video and see you guys in the next one